Oh boy, what a night it was, especially for Cougars fans at Rice Eccles Stadium. BYU remains undefeated after a win over Utah in this rivalry matchup. Fox 13 Sports anchor Jeff Renier talked to players and coaches after the game. Another great rivalry game. BYU remains undefeated. Their dream season continues while the Utes suffer another heartbreaking defeat. It was all Utes, though, in the first half. They built a 21-10 lead, and the fans here at Rice-Eccles Stadium were feeling good about the Utes going into the second half. But the Cougars dominated the second half, scoring 12 straight points, ending with a 44-yard field goal from Will Farron that won the game for the Cougars 22-21. I think my first football memory is my dad explaining the Holy War. Substitute teachers would come in and I'd raise my hand and ask if they're a BYU fan or a Utah fan. <laughs> and yeah, so it's cool. It's cool to be a part of it. I feel like I'm just a part of Cougar Nation. Um, it's cool to see BYU win this game and to be able to be in that role where I can do my part is pretty cool. It's been 18 years since a BYU quarterback won in the stadium and that was number 12 John Beck. So he texted me uh, yesterday. I was on the bus headed up here. Um, and I was just like, I just, going to try to go replicate what another number 12 did back in the day. When I was in the end zone, uh, my back in the end zone after going down, it wasn't a good feeling. Uh, looking up and seeing that, you know, we had new life, uh, the guys were confident, man. In two-minute drill, you talk to a lot of people, that first first down is the catalyst. And so that is a key thing to get. And uh, once we got it, however we get it, we started rolling, and so it was fun. It was a different post-game reaction from the Utes athletic director, Mark Harlan, and Kyle Woodingham both upset with officiating after the game. This game was absolutely stolen from us. We were excited about being in the Big 12, but tonight I am not. We won this game, someone else stole it from us. Very disappointed, I will talk to the commissioner. This was not fair to our team. I'm disgusted by the professionalism of the officiating crew tonight. Unfortunate way to lose a ball game. Uh, proud of our guys, proud of our players. They battled. They should hold their heads high. It's not on them. It's not on them. They played hard. They did uh, everything they could from start to finish. Things out there were ridiculous. Game was all but over. Yeah, it was over, but then it wasn't. It's kind of been the story for several games. We play lights out and just can't get that one last stop. Thank you. The Utes will try to get back into the winning column next Saturday against Colorado while BYU faces Kansas as they look for their 10th straight win this season. From Rice Eccles Stadium, Jeff Reinier, Fox 13 Sports, Utah.